I am going to make puppy chow. So first what you want to do is you want to buy the rice checks. Um, this is the best kind to use for the puppy chow. So what I did is I took a box and I poured it in this big bowl, like so. Then you just kind of set it off to the side so it's sitting there. Um, I like to buy Nestle milk chocolate, um, chocolate chips. You're gonna need vanilla. You're gonna need peanut butter. You're going to need butter. Okay, so right now what we're gonna do is, it usually calls for like pretty much the whole bag of the, um, one box calls for one bag. I use a whole bag. Sometimes it's like, I think the real recipe, it's like three fourths of the bag, but I use the whole bag. So what you're gonna do, eh, eh, eh. Sorry, that's my dog. You're gonna pour the chocolate chips in your bowl, okay? And then you want, well, we'll do the vanilla last. You want one cup of peanut butter. So you take the peanut butter. Put it in a cup like this. All right, so one cup of peanut butter. You just put it in the bowl like so. Try to get out as much as you can out of the cup. I put it in for measurement so I know how much I'm putting in. Um, use my little spatula here. Get the excess peanut butter off. Um, and then you need half a cup of butter. Woo! Don't do that. Don't get the butter all over the table. So, a little bit more than a half cup. Half cup of butter. Put it in there like so. Okay, you want to do a teaspoon of vanilla. No, Bessie. This is not real dog food. Sorry, this is brand new, so I have to open it. Okay. So one teaspoon of vanilla. You can pour it in whenever you want. I just pour it in. Then you're going to microwave this until everything is melted and soft so it's like runny because you're going to want to um, pour it over the Chex Mix so it's got to be runny so I don't like it either. Ugh. I mean I don't, I, I don't like regular food. <laughs> anyway so I'm going to do that. I'm going to pause this video. I'm going to put this in the microwave, get it all melted down and then I'll be back. So I'm back. It took me about two minutes to melt this down. Big bowl 
like this for the cover. And what you're gonna do first is, um, let me see if I have a cup. Yeah, just make sure it's clean. So you're gonna take just a little bit of powdered sugar first and put it at the bottom like so of the bowl. putting it in, I believe, the refrigerator um, for a couple hours. What I do is I put it in my freezer, my deep freezer, overnight. And then um, by morning time, it's nice and cool. The chocolate's hardened. And it just tastes so good. So yummy. And this, my friend, is puppy cow. I hope you like it. I hope you try it. Let me know if you do in the comments. Um, Send me a picture, or put a picture in your video, or whatever you want to do. Let me know how you like it. I hope you enjoyed this. I will see y'all later.